In an ongoing Consumer Reports investigation into the stability of dressers, newly released government data showed dressers 30 inches tall and under have been linked to the deaths of small children. And these short dressers aren't covered by any mandatory or voluntary stability standards to protect consumers. A dresser of any height will be a tip over risk whenever a drawer is opened. So when you open a dresser drawer, the center of gravity shifts no matter the height of the dresser. So dressers that are 30 inches and lower are still a potential danger. According to the Consumer Product Safety Commission, every 17 minutes, an unsecured piece of furniture, appliance, or television tips over and injures or kills someone in the US. Most of the victims are children under six years old. There is a voluntary safety standard set by ASTM International, a standard setting organization, which specifies that dressers taller than 30 inches don't tip over when an extended drawer is loaded with 50 pounds of weight. But this voluntary safety standard does not apply to dressers 30 inches tall or shorter. Records released in June showed that at least five fatal tip overs were linked to dressers that measured 30 inches or lower. The standard was originally created for dressers taller than 30 inches because those were seen as the most likely to cause injury from a tip over. But as dressers have evolved since the time that the standard was created, we are seeing that shorter dressers as well pose a tip over danger. As part of its continued analysis, CR conducted three tip over tests on 17 dresser models marketed as measuring 30 inches tall and under to see if they are prone to tipping over. In test one, all the drawers were opened. All 17 dressers passed this test. In the second test, the top drawer was fully opened and a 50 pound weight was hung from the drawer front. In test three, a 50 pound weight was hung from the top drawer front and the weight was increased in one pound increments to a maximum of 60 pounds. More than half of the dressers, nine in total, failed all but one of the tests. But five dressers passed all of our tests including the $150 IKEA Nordly. Showing a stable, affordable dresser at this height is possible. Companies have the ability to do something about this epidemic. We've found that it is possible to build more stable dressers of any height. And our findings highlight the need for strong safety standards for all dressers, not just taller ones. Consumer Reports believes that the current voluntary standard isn't broad or robust enough to protect consumers and would like to see a strong, mandatory safety standard set for all dressers. In the meantime, CR recommends anchoring furniture to a wall. And when a product recall is announced, act on it immediately. For more on how to anchor furniture and CR's full tip-over testing results, go to cr.org tipover. <laughs>